Rescue teams continue looking for nine month old Conrad Shields. The baby's been missing for over a week now after being swept away by floodwaters in Bucks County. Action News reporter Becca Hendrickson was out with the Philadelphia Marine Unit today during the search. Weather like this certainly makes the search even more difficult. Still, Philadelphia police say they've been out on the Delaware every day looking for Conrad, and they're continuing to hold on to hope. Because we don't know where he is, we're just looking on the surface everywhere. The search for nine month old Conrad Shields, who was swept away in a Bucks County flood earlier this month, spans the length of the Delaware River from Washington Crossing to the Coast Guard base in South Philadelphia. We want closure for the family. We do our best. Sometimes we're successful and sometimes we're not. This is the fifth day that Lieutenant Andy Napoli and the Philadelphia Police Marine Unit have been out on the water since Conrad's older sister, Maddie was found in Port Richmond last Friday. We knew it would be kind of a long shot that um, Conrad would be in the same area, but we, we still took the effort. Search and rescue teams are using canines, aviation, land units. If something's on the bottom that sticks up, you can actually see that. And sonar, hoping to find the infant boy. Any type of debris. And because we're looking for Conrad, he's so small that it could be anything. It's a search that has become more challenging with time and is at the mercy of the tides. You see the, the, the tide mark, the high tide mark by the wet. And as the tide goes down, the walls stays wet and then eventually it dries up. But this team vows to be out here until they have answers for the Shields family. As long as it takes. You know, my hope is either us, another agency uh, finds them. Upper Makefield Township Police also said they had divers in the creek where Conrad disappeared today. His family most lately said they are holding on to hope for closure that he comes home. In South Philadelphia, Becca Hendrickson, Channel 6 Action News.